so today as you can see I've got no hair in which means one thing and that is a tutorial. Um, as you know I love hair pieces so today I want to show you one of my new favourite hair pieces which is um, one of the Frankie Essex pieces and it is called the Bouncy Curled Clipping Extension. Basically it's like a three quarter wig so you can see how big it is here. There's clips at the top and then there's two clips at the nape of the neck. So you can either apply this with your hair all down, just like clip up a little bit of a section and then clip underneath, or you can sort of clip half up and then put the rest up in a bun. So um, today I'm gonna to show you that way, well, cause that's the way I always do it. So I clip all of my hair up, leave the fringe out. Um, and yeah, I'll show you how I get that look. First of all, I'll section the front of my hair off. And then I'll section the top part up here and just clip that into a small bun using a curvy grip. The rest of my hair, as you can see here, is going to be clipped up and hidden away. Please ignore my massive huge long roots because they need to go. And I'm booking an appointment on Monday, okay? Sorry about that. For extra security, if you need to, you can back comb this top section to make sure the clips stay in. I don't need to because I've, I think I've got the knack of it now, but if you want to, you can. So just using some curvy grits, I'm just going to secure that in place. Now that is all secure, I'll just show you what it looks like. It's nothing too impressive, so don't be too taken back if you can't see a perfect little bun there. Um, obviously some of you have got really long thick hair and some of you haven't got much hair, so these pieces are great for that. So just check out what I've got. Nothing too sexy going on there. Thank God I'm gonna hide it now with this piece. So just keep watching just to see what I'm doing. I'm going to ungrip this top section here and let it fall on top. And voila, long hair. If you're wearing all of your hair down, you don't need to clip these bottom clips in, but I'll just do that now because obviously I've got it up, so it'll just make it extra secure. That's the added security there, so you don't feel like it's going to fall out. It's so secure, like I don't think like it's going to come out at all. Um, to hide the join at the back, what I usually do is use a backcombing brush, which I just bought off of eBay for like £2, and I'll backcomb this top section up here to um, keep my hair covered over it. So I'll just show you how I do that. Wow, my roots are so awful. I think I want to go blonder next time. I do love having blonde locks. So if you've got longer hair, you can obviously curl sections of your hair just to blend in with this piece. If you've got short hair like mine, obviously it's just quite nice wearing it flicky like that and then you've got the long piece down here. And I'll just show you how gorgeous it looks from the front. How amazing is that? I love it. I love this hair piece, just so you know. If you want to get yours, then you can just go to Glitz Glam. Um, Sally's Glitz Glam, it's called. Um, I'll link the website down below. Add the guys on Twitter because they're fantastic. And if you need colour matching, they'll tweet you back. All you need to do is send them a little photo. Um, 
yeah so i hope you like this little mini tutorial and if you want to see more with my other hair pieces please let me know because i have a massive collection of hair pieces because i'm addicted so yeah um let me know what else you want to see guys and please do check out my blog um i'll leave the link down below as well i'll speak to you soon guys bye